so let's let's go to the traffic sources tab which is over here on the left toolbar you can see all the different commands you can see uh, where you can go you can go to views demographics playback locations or traffic sources this is what we are interested in right now now the traffic sources graph will look like this by default and if you scroll down a bit you can see an actual list of all the traffic that is coming to your to your channel divided or, or categorized according to the source so our primary traffic source for this particular video that we are working on is YouTube suggested videos which means that it's able to target a lot of good videos on YouTube and YouTube is showing it on the right side or on the right toolbar of several videos due to which it's getting a lot of traffic from YouTube suggested videos and if I click on this or if I open this data in a new window I can actually see a list of all the videos or of actually the top 25 videos that my video is showing on adjacent to so the top video here is this one it's definitely going to be a very popular video because it's bringing me a lot of traffic so undoubtedly it's it must be a lot of it must be a very popular video and yep yeah, it's it's not a very old video it's got a lot of views and it's getting a lot of views even now and I'm appearing on the right side on the right toolbar so similarly I must be appearing on the right toolbar of all these videos because of which I'm getting a lot of traffic from them right so uh, I told you earlier how to appear on the right side of other videos the trick is to target the same keywords and the same similar headlines so to start with use the same keywords in your headline that the other video is using then uh, you need to find out what keywords they are using you can use a tool like traffic jeet to discover those keywords and then you can use those keywords in your own video and there is a pretty strong chance that you will start appearing on the adjacent toolbar or on the right side of the video that you're targeting and i found that this is a pretty good source of traffic and for me it has brought a lot of traffic in the past uh, i would recommend that you target youtube search as the number one source of traffic and the suggested video as the number two source of traffic so you must get the bulk of your visitors from search and the second biggest chunk from suggested videos but sometimes this will be changing a bit like in this one because we are ranking probably on some very good videos now there is the external website button or external website link now the external website means that you are getting traffic from your links on some other website so if we click on it we will get to see a name of those websites so I'm getting traffic from Google of course which this is organic search traffic on Facebook where my video must have been shared on Yahoo on ask.com from mails whenever people mail each other about my video or when Google mails people about my video so from all these sources I'm getting tra I'm getting traffic so keep out an eye on all these sources and now and then you will find uh, a new website which might have referred to you or which might have linked to you you can go there have a look and if you like the website if you think there is a scope of having a relationship with the webmaster you can talk to him or you can ask him to feature other videos that you're making so all of this can be a great way to find leads to promote your website so keep an eye out on the external website tabs the next is YouTube search the direct traffic is the traffic of course that that came directly to my channel or to my video and we're gonna ignore that because there's nothing much that you can play with it so coming to YouTube search you click on this and you will get to see a list of keywords that this video is ranking for so this video is ranking for some really solid keywords dictionary words and two letter keywords and if you rank well for these keywords you will definitely get traffic so target these keywords in the headline like I, I am showing you I'm, I've begun the headline with the keyword and I'm ranking for it and this keyword I've targeted in the headline in the description and also in the keyword section so do this and you will get the proof of putting yourself you will get to see how you can rank so easily and so well next we have Google search 
if you optimize your video for YouTube search, you are going to be automatically optimized for Google search. So when people look for what you've produced on Google, there is a chance that your video will appear in the search results. For example, I'm ranking this video on introduce yourself. And if I click on this little link over here, it will take me to Google and it will show me where I'm ranking. So I'm on the first page of Google for this term. And no wonder I'm getting a lot of traffic from Google on this. So this is how it works. This is how the traffic sources command works. And there are some more things that you can see. You can see that a lot of traffic is coming to me from playlists. And in an earlier chapter, I told you how to optimize playlists. Basically, the mandate is to create a lot of different playlists, targeting a lot of different keywords and use those playlists as a magnet of traffic. And remember, don't just fill in the playlists with just your own videos. Try to put in some other relevant videos from other people also, but make sure your video is the first one in the playlist. That's very important. The reason is simple. The first video will be the video to play to which will be mandatorily played whenever somebody runs a playlist. So if they come to your playlist, they're going to see your video. And if they don't like the video, they might skip to the next one, but they've already seen it. So make sure you put your best video on the top of the playlist that you create. Then we have the YouTube channel page, which is actually the YouTube home that we have just seen. And you can get traffic from the YouTube channel page by using the unsubscribe trailer. Set any video that you want to promote to the unsubscribe trailer and you will get traffic from the first page of Google uh, home page or your YouTube home page using this technique. The YouTube guide is what uh, YouTube sends out to your subscribers or to YouTube users through email or online and if your video is featured there some people will come to you from there too and finally YouTube advertising if you enrolled for YouTube advertising and if you've been approved YouTube will show some advertisements for your channel and for your videos on maybe the right sidebar or even other places and you will get some visitors from that too so keep an eye this is this is the most important part of the analytics your traffic sources keep an eye on each of these understand how you can use them and you will be able to use this information to get better rankings for your video and for your channel so right now we were seeing uh, just this speed video and if you want to see the stats for your entire channel just click on the little close button the cross over here and now you will get to see the same stats for your entire channel and that's where you can find things like your best keywords you can find out what your best keywords are what you're getting ranked for and where the bulk of your traffic is coming from so give this a whirl give this traffic sources tab a close look and understand where your traffic is coming from and how you can make it better for yourself.